to oh. head to town and find a burger yeah. joint. Platform 145, fried chicken burger. Yeah. Ridiculous. Mm. Ten out of ten. Yeah. But all the burgers are pretty popular. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Nice size, um, the taste. What's up, peoples? Welcome to the channel. Today we're going to find the best burger here in Wally. And let me ask these guys where the best burger in Wally is. Where? What's the best burger in Wally? Oh. Okay. Greek friends. This is my Greek friends. I'm gonna mm. ask him first. I don't Best know if burger. they even do burgers, but where? Oh, platform 145, fried chicken burger. Ridiculous. Yeah, ridiculous. Platform, the, oh, yeah. platform 145 on Willis Street. Okay. I, th I don't think that's spoken about enough. Underrated. Go there. Mate. There's a satay one, I think, as well. Try both of them. I'll try any burger, man, but uh, yeah. I'm from Wally, so I know a lot of burger places and I like a lot of burgers but today we're probably going to go look for something that we don't really see a lot of the time so I'm looking for something different And that's, what do you think that's going to be? Uh, I don't know, we're going to go inner city We're just going to have a look Just a beautiful day okay. we'll Sounds good on a day like this. That's it Yeah We're going to take you guys to see the best burger in Wellington We're going to go in search We're going to search We're going to turn up every brick Behind every tree <laughs> Underneath every seat and we're gonna find the burgers in Wally because we can. Right. Actually, I gotta go see my man here in the cafe. See what he says. Where's the big, uh, best uh, burger joint, bruh? Uh, McDonald's. Oh. Of course, you say McDonald's. Which big one? Mac. Big, big Mac. Big Mac. <laughs> That's my man here. Anyway, before we go, if you haven't El Rancho Bay, pull up to uh, Cosmos Coffee. To tell him because I can't send you. And you're not going to get a discount, so don't mention my name. Okay? Don't mention my name because my name, my credit is bad over here. But anyway, we're going to shoot off. What's the burger, brother? Uh, best burger, Lucky, I'd say. Lucky burger. Yeah? You rate that? Yeah. It's the best. A one to ten. Chicken, yeah, I'd say give it an eight. Yeah? Solid eight. Okay. Where's it located? Okay. It's Bro, uh, do you want to say, wait, what's your best burger, brother? Best burger? Yeah. Lucky chicken, Courtney Place. Lucky like chicken, one, one to ten, or one to ten. Well, what do you give it? Ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. Yeah. How good's the gravy yeah. on, on the side? No, nah, no gravy. You got a favorite burger? Put? Enjoy it. Same. Same. Lucky chicken. Right? Okay, chicken, there you heard it. Chicken, the yeah. people have spoken. Yeah. But um, yeah. Honestly, we're gonna go find out Wally's be um, best burger. So, stay tuned to the channel. Hit the notification button. Come on, get me up. I want some Spanian numbers, bruh. Let's go. What's up? What's up, man? Because so I can. Where are we going? Uh, today we're in Wellington. We're going to look at some burger places and maybe do a burger uh, review. Review. So That's I'm a it. bit of a burger specialist and we're going to go around Wellington, look for a burger place, and then we're going to review that burger. So because okay. I can, like and subscribe, get That's those it. numbers up. Yeah, so we're going to go check out Wally's um, best burger places. Um, at least one of them anyway. We're gonna go check it out and see what you people think. So we out of here. So let's go. You know, you've seen this guy. <laughs> you've seen this guy from the meat pie and the fish and chip uh, video, right? That's right. he have been missing in action. What have you been up to, bro? Oh, you know, I've been quite busy. I make uh, trips to Wellington all the time, but I live in the wild upper and I come see my friends like Cos. And then on special days, we get to do food reviews and do a bit of vlogging and a little bit of channel work. So, yeah, yeah, that's it. So, we're going to head to town and find a burger joint so we can have a burger and then we'll see. If it's up to standard because everybody has their own burger favorite you know some people might be just basic and say go to Macca's or places like that and there's burger fuel and all, all the other burger places Wisconsin and so on and so on but there's a joint in town there's one shop in town actually my man over here introduced me to the to the burger spot That's right, so we're man. gonna go and check it out we'll we'll show you when we get there so right now we're in our rental bay beautiful beautiful weather out here it is 
look at that. Just another typical day in the capital city of Wellington. Yeah. That's it. And my man over here is a bit of a lyricist uh, guy. A lyricist guy? Yeah, a bit of a rap dude. I do music, yeah. Yeah, hip hop music. That's right, that's, that's right. It. Look, oh, look, the sun's sort of uh, slowly disappearing. But so, nonetheless, it's a, it's a nice day. It is, it is. So, yeah, people, um, it's good to hook up with, uh, it's good to catch up with my man Tama here. It's been a while since we did a video together, so I just thought, why not? Today is the day. And uh, he was free, I was free, and the people, you guys are watching it for free. Yeah. So, just give it, uh, give the video a like and um, see what you think, and um, we'll give you the content. That's right. We'll see you soon with the top burgers. That's it. Well, we'll see. We shall see. <laughs> Kent Terrace, corner of Courtney Place. Wellington City yeah a lot of memories on that uh, on Kent Terrace right there is man a lot of good memories a lot of good places here the embassy yeah the embassy is right there on our left Peter Jackson's little studio studio I mean uh, theater. movie theater movie theater that is where they had uh, Lord of the Rings um, premieres over the years that's right Courtney Place being the biggest one of the biggest streets in Wellington one of the most popular streets for nightlife uh, food, uh, clubbing, dancing, all that kind of stuff. So, so we used to spend a lot of time there and as younger dudes. And that's the streets here we, we're about to turn into. Courtney Place is uh, right down here in Welly City. So if you know, you know. I, I know a lot of you guys watching this probably spend a lot of time in the clubs here. That's right. Shout out to Over anyone that lived here and moved away. Yeah, it's big shout out to you guys watching in from wherever you're watching it from. Uh, especially people that used to live here in Welly. Taking you guys down memory lane, Courtney Place. So here at Courtney Place we are. Here in Courtney Place. And the time is it's before lunchtime. Pretty empty actually. <laughs> A lot of public transport. Yeah. A lot of people walk to and from work. A lot of people get their lunches and their breaks and go down to um, the skate park or the, or the waterfront down by the museum. Yeah, and, and Courtney Place, a lot of good food places. And big shout out to uh, KC, um, uh, KC uh, Chinese uh, restaurant, there. Uh, restaurant sort of takeaway and eat in place. Pork belly, duck. Yeah. We've got to do exactly. everything there. We've so here, we're, we're going right past KC here. The Reading uh, Cinemas. Tell them about the back in the day, the Reading Cinema. Reading Cinemas. Crown of Mountain days. <laughs> so back when that was open, they had like a McDonald's in there, but they had a lot of um, all-you-can-eat type buffet restaurant places, like Chinese. And um, me and Cos, we were pros at it, man. We were so good at it. We used to pile up all the food till the lady would look at us and, and tell us off. Um, because we had put too much on our plates. So there used to be a little game we used to play. Yeah, we call it Pile of Mountain. <laughs> yeah. Back in the day. I'm sure Cos is banned, even though it's shut down. Bro, this guy, his photo was on there. You go there, there's a photo. Don't serve this guy. That was this, this dude right here. Had all my details on the wall. Way hidden little spot. Yeah, right across here used to be a bar. Remember the student nights used to be over here on the left, right back in the day, right? Yeah, that's right. Zip. Everybody got driving game like me. Oh, it's busy today. Yeah. So. So here. 
Remember that place? <laughs> yeah. Okay, we're here. We had this spot here. Now here's the spot. Okay, we're here where we're at. What's up, people? We're just off Cuba Street up the top here. I don't know the name of this street, but we are at what Abel I... Abel Smith Street. Abel Smith Street, and this is my secret burger place. So today, I'm going to take Cos on a little adventure through here. Um, it looks like a tagged up uh, food truck, but don't let it deceive you. Looks like a shipwreck in here, but the food, bellissimo. Okay. So, we're going to this spot here. Burger joint right here in the middle of town, top of Cuba Street and Abel Smith. Right at lunchtime, a few people here. It's the menu here. A lot of different the menu. burgers. Burgers. Now, what I didn't know is they do burritos as well, so. What's that? They do burritos as well. Okay. On the small list. I didn't know they are full of strictly burgers. So my bro, how are you? Good, good. Busy today? Uh, yeah, busy. Um, we'd like to order some burgers, please. I'd like to get the Esther Classic. And then I'll get a... Uh, where's that one I've seen with the bacon? I'll get a Danny, Danny. please. We'll get, what we're getting, we're getting a Danny and Danny, an Esther. That's, that's a bacon burger and a Esther's their classic. And okay. I'll get one chips and we'll get two drinks as well, please. Okay. What's this burger joint like, brother? Uh, it's pretty sweet. Yeah? yeah? Not bad. Okay. We'll wait for it, man. Thank you, brother. We're at the burger joint now, and we'll wait and see getting our order. We okay. ordered our, what we get? We got an Esther burger, which is kind yeah. of like their namesake burger, and then I got what's called a Danny. Uh, all the burgers yeah. here are named especially after people's names, but the Danny is basically bacon and avocado, and the bro just got And the Esther is the classic, Thank it's their right. classic burger. So my burger costs 10 bucks, his Mom burgers was 15. 15 so we'll, we'll see we'll compare uh, not only taste size and price price so it cost us uh, the two burgers plus chips what do you get chips, chips and we've got drinks. drinks that's 39 bucks 39 bucks give me you guys getting hungry burger. Yeah. we're in the capital city here Wellington's very special to us we lived a long time here We've eaten a lot of food um, around these parts, so um, I understand this place has been here for a while, maybe um, five to six years, but I never really noticed it was something because of the way it looks, as you can see around us, there's stuff above us, unfinished. Yeah, look at, look at, look at this place here. It's pretty out of it. Uh. <laughs> Very urban street, there's a lot of um, street yeah. graph here. It's Shout like to the graffiti artists that done the work. It's like, it's like props from, uh, like one of those B-grade uh, movies about urban areas in New York or, you know, yeah, the States exactly. or something like that. Um, but we're here for the food. But the place looks pretty unique. <laughs> so, yeah, one of our first of our burger series, bringing you the best burgers in Wally. It's a lot of burger joints, a lot of burger joints. Eating a lot of burgers in my day. And this is my second time I've been here. So we will tell you what the going on. My man, right, Tama. Man. All good? I'm good, man. How are you, Cos? Cos I can TV. Like and subscribe. Yeah. Uh, I'm here to um, test some burgers out and review them. And I'm the burger guy. This guy, not the burger guy. <laughs> Everybody thinks they're a burger guy. But... Yeah, it's been a while since I had a good burger, so today we'll make sure we got the best, but we'll see. 
we will see. What do you reckon makes a good burger, Tama? Well, guys, listen closely, man. Burgers are about condiments, the right little uh, onions. I like onions in mine. I like the right mayonnaise. Uh, best foods mayo. If you know, you know in New Zealand. That's the mayo we use. I love a good egg. Um, yeah, good egg in your burger? I love an egg burger, man. I like all elements in the burger. Good bun, hold it all together. Not too sloppy. I like a bit of spice, not too much spice, but as long as it doesn't taste bland. And I know these people deliver, so I'm looking forward. Mouth-watering, mouth-watering. I think Tom has talked up this burger now. <laughs> <laughs> now they better bring it, because this guy's talking it up. So, um, man, even before we even eat this burger, he's already given it almost like a 10 out of 10. But we will see, we will see. Hey, brother. Hey, brother, how are you? Good, thank you. Hey. Yeah. Yeah. We came back to we, do the we review. came back to do the review of your burger joint. Oh right, that's right. And here's a uh, man. You're the owner. No, I'm no. the manager. Okay, manager. Okay. How, how long has this spot been here? Um, about seven years. Okay. What what's our go to? What most people? What burger do most people get here? Well, all the burgers are pretty popular, but we get a lot of students, so um, yeah. and we've got a good price point, so they yeah. tend to go for the smaller, cheaper ones. We sell yeah. lots of those. So what, what's this one here? Um, we've got a Monique and a Pearl Schwab. Monique? Yep. Okay. A Monique and a Pearl Schwab. Why do you name them after people? Or names of... Oh, uh, some of them are named after the owner's family. Yep. And some of them were existing names. Yep. Okay. Yeah. And the name Ekim? Um, it's Mike spelled backwards. Oh! oh. Yeah. Oh, it, that's pretty genius, it eh? Is. So the, the place here is called Ekim. It's Mike spelt backwards That's I didn't know see so learn something new every day yeah, learn well, something new yeah, every day Mike spelled backwards so let's uh, see if we can eat our burger backwards like Mike Ecom Mike spelled backwards that's the name of the of this burger joint is this spot a, a popular spot yeah we're popular as yeah so this is our order here okay Mike okay. thank you we're gonna enjoy, enjoy these Burger. So, so, what's that, brother? This is called the. We got to learn the names over and over, but this one is called the Danny. Danny. So the Danny has um, streaky bacon in it, egg, patty, obviously some beautiful um, iceberg lettuce, tomato. They got a relish in there, fresh uh, red onion. It's one of the plate reasons why I come here is just all the lovely ingredients that they use here, no shortcuts. Okay, and this one here, let me, this one here, that's the Emic Classic. It's one of the students' favorite, rightly yeah. priced and just as good as this one. Just doesn't have the egg in it or the bacon, so. This burger is called an Esther, as you can see there, burger. Another shot of this. There's a lot of um, lettuce yeah. there, but damn, man. So, let's go. Cheers, brother. To the channel. That's it. Now we're going to take first bite. Okay, you go, you go. Oh, man. Where do I begin? Mm. I'm honestly speechless. Now, big boys like me, the size of a burger is pretty important. These are huge. For only 15 bucks, it's got more bacon than your average bacon sandwich. Freshly made patties here. Good eggs. I mean... Nice. Let me dig into the Esther. Esther burger. See, tomatoes, lettuce, um, and a pretty thick beef patty right there pretty beefy let me take a bite of this mm. Mm. <laughs> mm. you know what for 10 bucks this is pretty decent mm. very decent as it tastes really good. Burgers are hectic. But 
guaranteed you won't be disappointed size um, the taste just right fresh salad or you know lettuce and tomatoes in it plus a thick meat patty dude mm. boy I try to tell him mm. a lot of busy burger places or food places will pre-make food these are all made to order they make the patties while you're ordering it freshly cook it there and then so there's a real element of like like your mum's made you a burger from home. Mm. It's like a homely feeling to it. Here's the fries, or well, chips. Chips, mate. Chips, mate. Chips are chips. I think we've all know what the chips are, but mm. they're good too. <laughs> and cheap. So if you Wellington University students don't know yet, they got cheap $10 burgers down here, man. All you students not far from Taranaki Street, not far from the Massey University there. And the thing, we didn't get paid to say this. We have to pay for our own burgers. So hopefully, <laughs> if this review is good and people see it, maybe the next time we pull up here, dude will give us a, a freebie or something. But anyway, that's another story. But the main thing is we had to do burgers. So far, I give it, I give this burger probably an 8, 8.5 out of 10, mm. which is good. What about you? I'm like, cause nothing's 10 until I've met it. So um, mm. for now, 8. But I mean, the more I eat into this, it's like a beetroot relish. It's beautiful Look spices. Look at the color in here. You can see the beetroot. It's almost falling apart, mustard. I mean, on a good day, I don't know if you could beat this burger, but we'll still give it eight out of 10. Now, spoken like, spoken like a dude that really knows their burger. <laughs> this guy's eaten a lot of burgers in his day. No cap. Yeah, no cap. <laughs> He's the, the burger burglar, the burglar. <laughs> hey, the burglar, that's Ham, it. Hamburglar. <laughs> the hamburglar. <laughs> Definitely, it's a spot that you must try if you're ever in Welly. I mean, decent price. Like you said, the, the guy said that this burger, actual burger here that I've got here, it's called uh, Esther. It's very popular with the students, with the uni students, because around this area, a lot of uni students. So, this very affordable for them. Only takes one and you're full. And that's the good thing about this. You know, if you don't have much money you got your last ten dollars that you want to spend on something i think this burger is a go-to definitely mm, car pie yeah guys it's worth it worth the trip to come down and check out this burger joint right here on top of cuba street and um cuba street and abel smith um street it's this uh Eek Eekum burgers which is Mike backwards how was your burger no, it's great the best, best burgers in town definitely. well what did you get um, I got the, the Monique yeah. oh yeah yeah Monique and what did you get brother uh, Paul's Rob yeah. yeah it's good worth it, it. this is your first time over here no, 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 no. oh regular yeah. oh, thank <laughs> you we're trying to tell the audience uh, definitely is a spot uh, highly recommended this place definitely yeah yeah no, we'll, we'll keep coming back yeah yeah definitely. there you heard it welly <laughs> Definitely. Thank, thanks, guys. You're welcome. Yeah. So, there yeah, we've just spoken to some guys that just had the burger. They reckon this is their local spot. So, these guys reckon this is their local spot. They come here all the time. So, they know better than I do. But uh, I can guarantee that you will be satisfied. I'm not just saying it because, like I said, we had to pay for these burgers. So, and the other thing, big ups to. Um, my man Frank, big ups to Frank and uh, Triple Threat. This hat from Triple Threat, I keep rocking a lot of these hats on uh, on my channel. Also the hoodie, Triple Threat. So if you want to cop that, go on Instagram, get yourself some merch from uh, Triple Threat. I rock them because not only uh, that's my friend's label, but it also looks dope. Look at this. So Surprisingly good. 
what? Yeah, surprisingly. Well, this guy comes here all the time. He, he's the guy that really introduced me to this burger joint. I've seen it many times. I've gone past it, never stopped. But this guy put, told me we need to go and do this burger review. And thank you, my man. Thank you, my bro, Cole. My, my bro. You know, if you want to see my man on more videos, drop it down the link. I've been trying to get this guy to start his own YouTube channel. So hopefully that's coming sometime soon. It is. <laughs> and might work. start Saturday. I've got, <laughs> I've got a little thing I'm doing on Saturday and I might just video it and review it and get, get the train running. That's it, why not? But thanks to Cos. Hello guys. Um, yeah. Hi. I've just met these guys at this burger joint. Uh, they just had the burger. What do you think of the burger? Well, no, we're just about to get our burger, so we're waiting for it. But, okay. burger, yeah. but I've been here before, and the burgers are super, man. They're really good. Okay, yeah. before we start, actually, I should ask your name. <laughs> What's your name, sir? Uh, my name's George Angus, and this is Anna. Anna Kingman. <laughs> yeah, and you're both from? Scotland. Scotland, yeah. <laughs> so, big ups to Scotland. What's yeah. going on? <laughs> well, we're here, for, here for lunch. So, oh, yeah, they, got, they just got their burger. Oh, yeah. And, um... Thank you so my friend um, Jade, if you're watching this from uh, Scotland in the borders. Yeah. What's going on? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> so here's the burger. Yeah, burger. What did you get, sir? I got the, um, I can't remember, the beef burger. We had ham, bacon, a jalapeno, and I got a cheeseburger. Just a cheeseburger. Oh, wow. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Looks pretty meaty there. Yeah, yeah. Okay, let's 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 look at that. Okay, put it up. Okay, yeah. we'll, we'll, we'll form you. <laughs> nice. Mmm. That's a tasty burger. <laughs> I wish yours like Anna. Mm. Yeah. Mm. You couldn't get the tomato sauce, mate, could you? <laughs> yeah, thank you very much. Ten out of ten. Mm. Ten out of ten? Mm. Mm. For first time too? Yep. Wow. Brilliant. Cheers, man. See, welcome to Wellington. You guys came all the way from uh, Scotland. And at least now you can report back to Scotland to your people back in Scotland yeah, yeah. that you came and you had one of the best burgers. Yeah, absolutely. Best in burger in the city. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I love I love the accent. Best burger in the city. <laughs> <laughs> right in That's good, is it? No. no. I need to. Sorry, guys. I need to brush up on my Scottish accent. <laughs> when I, <laughs> but anyway, I just met these people and these lovely people here from uh, from Scotland and yeah. they actually approached me they said look they want to they want to send a message to the people in scotland yeah, yeah, and yeah. to say that to their families in scotland that they a they're safe in welly and also they just had the the best burger in welly mm. <laughs> totally okay yeah. any 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 last any shout outs say hello to your mum shout out to my mum joanne hi okay. mum <laughs> uh, yeah. yeah let's go say hello that's it yep. hey thank you thank you so thank much you. <laughs> cheers you know okay great thing about doing this channel like I said it's all about meeting people today we came to do a review on this burger joint because I heard so much about it and I'm here and I'm glad to report that it's all gravy and it's hectic the burgers is hectic uh, these guys gave it a 10 out of 10 and mm. yourself sir 10 out of 10 fantastic wow. I recommend it yeah are the burgers really bad in Scotland <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying I'm just saying but um you know some of them are yeah the biggest but yeah so yeah, there, there it goes. You know, you heard it from these guys. I did not force them to say it. Mm. That's their own opinion. And um, big, big ups to the to the burger joint. And you people, if you haven't been here, make sure you pull up. And anyway, peace out. Yeah, yeah. Thanks, guys. Uh, where would you, you put this up in a yeah. few days or something? Yeah, yeah, where yeah. We'll, where will tag you in it? Yeah. YouTube channel is KOS mm -hmm. space I space can. Right here. See, and that's the thing we do we network with people uh, yeah. just to get the channel name out there and what we do yeah. and like I said it's all good here in Wally everything's good um, glad we came here and did a review on this burger joint and until next time so if you've got a burger place that uh, you want us to check out in the city or somewhere around New Zealand hopefully we can get to it let us know even in Australia so there we came we ate and I'd have to say it was pretty pretty good. Tumble what, was on. Let's just say that. Thank you. That's it. You Thank know. you, boss man. So, yeah, we had a year. We came, we ate. And I'd have to say it was pretty good. Pretty good. And that's it. Hectic.